Amazing Grace. Hey guys, um, I'm gonna be showing you all my fidget spinners and which one I think is the best and you should get. So I've got a light up, I've got an average every day, and then I've got a glow in the dark light, wait, silent. So yeah, um, I'm gonna start with my first one I ever got, which was this one. It's a black, pink, and purple, and it is an ABEC5. It looks really weird in the camera. And yeah, so that's that. And then I got, which one did I get first? I got this one. Yeah, this one. This is my lightweight glow-in-the-dark with a push-out bearing, which always drives me really crazy. I try and do it on camera. And it's really funny because it, like, okay, hold on, let me get down to the bottom. It spins itself to the top. It, it, it's funny. Okay. Let me get that back in. Mm. That one spins silent, and I really do like it. And then I've got this one. This is probably my least favorite. I did get the light up in the dark tonight. But, it lights up, it spins, but these pop off. And whenever they do, you just have to sort of deal with them until you can get them to go back on right. And you just spin by the bearing, which I do not like doing. So, yeah. So if I were you, I would either get a glow in the dark, because I mean, duh, you can do it at night, or just, you know, your normal everyday fidget spinner. I would not go for a lineup just because I've had a bad experience if I was to get another one or get somebody a birthday present that was a fidget spinner. I would not ever get them a lineup just because of my experience. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching. And if you think they look like Mickey Mouse, comment down below. Talk to y'all later. Bye. Bye.